Today's episode is brought to you by LastPass. Yeah, man, click on the link below. Find out how you can be safer thanks to LastPass. What do we call this shot? Get ready for the blow gun card target shooting trick. It's <laughs> a good name. Here we go. Yeah! <laughs> You ready? Yep. Here we go. It's like clear. Woo! Open. You can move! Yeah, get out of here. <laughs> oh, let's see what it looks like. <laughs> nice! <laughs> yes. I'll just stand still. There you go. Don't move. There you go. Nice! <laughs> It dented the can. It dented the can. That's awesome. I thought you said you weren't gonna throw it that hard. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that, right there. Mm. It's for you. Thank All you. Right. All right, you ready? Take it away. Oh! oh! That was amazing! <laughs> Look at that. What? Oh, sweet Christmas. Oh, holy crap. Hi. Whoa. Wow, look at your finger. Hi. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Hi. Hey. Oh, no. <laughs> I thought we were done. For card handling flourishes. All right, Murphy, you feeling it? I'm feeling it. You look like a magician right now. Really? Yeah. You got cards in your hands. You ready? <laughs> and he's out. <laughs> We're back again with Rick Smith Jr., three-time world record up? holder. Last time you taught us how to shoot accurately, I guess throwing cards for distance and accuracy. That's not something you can run around doing all the time every day. No. Uh, but you can look like an awesome gambler flinging cards around with a deck of cards, right? Yeah, do you want to learn some moves? Yeah, what do you got? All right, why don't we start with uh, popping a card out of the deck. Okay. It's called a pop-up card, where you can actually pop out a card out of the deck and catch it in the middle. Simple. Simple, what? Jason. If I could catch it, me simple. So pop it up. Catch it, and that's how you do it. Okay, so, so it, it looks like you're holding the cards as a block on your right side. Yes, but this is not the first step of oh. learning how to do this. Oh, no, okay. So even though you're flicking up the card and you're catching it in your other hand, if you don't want to catch it in the middle of the deck, right? you want to start this with only one playing card. This will get you uh, the spin uh, technique. So you're going to put it... Between thumb and forefinger. Yep, and you're going to take your pointer finger, and you're going to move it into this area. So but what's going like, to happen... Like you're making an okay symbol? Yes. Okay, but what you're gonna do is you're gonna take this off the nail. So you're gonna keep bending it. He got it. I didn't mean to. <laughs> <laughs> it was an accident. Oh <laughs> man, I just got showed up by Murphy. <laughs> this is killing me. Okay, oh, like, like that? Okay. So you're gonna hold the card at a 45 degree angle. Yeah. You're gonna take your pointer finger and bring it into this area. What you need to do is you need to take your the card off of your fingernail. That'll give you this nice flick up. Both uh, you guys got it. Great. Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> Add that and to they the... don't do trick shots. <laughs> Add that to the montage, man. <laughs> That's awesome. I kept trying to do this with the fleshy part of my finger, but it really is important that you build that tension, you curl over, and once it hits that nail, it just slides it's right off. It's slide right off. Because you can't hold it with your nail. Yeah. So once you have this down pat, you can give a little bit of push with your thumb to give it a ah. little upwards motion, like that. And then, all you do in the same move with the entire deck of cards. You're holding it with your middle and thumb. Okay. You're bringing that card back, and you're letting it go off the fingernail. Oop, that wasn't it. Look, look, look. Okay. Off the fingernail. <laughs> I'm doing it off the back. All right. There. Oh, That's wow. It. Yeah. So with practice, there's lots of cool things. You can fling it up, catch it. And you can even do the down. sucker one. What's the sucker one? Oh, that's good. The trick sucks. Okay. <laughs> All right, get, Jason, I want to see you do the sucker. Oh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> nope. <laughs> I just look like I'm trying to kiss the card. Oh, no. All right, hold, so on, hold on. He's going to get it. Ah. <laughs> I love that you're just chasing it. That's great. I am. Yeah! Oh, I did it! You got it. That was good, that was good. That was good. <laughs> and 
And if you have awesome cameras like you do, you can actually shoot them at the camera like this, giving you the best rapid fire flick you could possibly That's come so up with. Good. That's so good. That's so. Are you doing the same thing? Same thing, but I'm just going as fast as I can. I'm flicking and like this. Yeah, I'm. I'm not gonna be able to do that. That one looks like the result of years of practice. <laughs> there you got oh, it. Oh wait, all right, hold on. You can't do it. With just a couple cards. There you oh, go. Oh, oh. You oh, got oh, it. Oh, you got it. I did get it. Ah, Murphy, I'm doing it. You're doing it. Yeah, I've never been able to get it rapid fire until now. That's great. Yeah, that's awesome. Wow. I even take my middle finger and sometimes give a little bit of a bow here. Uh, I did notice that having it bowed correctly made a huge difference. There it is. There it is. There it is. And with a little bit of practice, you'll be able to fling it up with one hand and yeah. catch it in the middle of the deck. Jason Murphy, it's Brian Brushwood. <laughs> like you don't know who it is. <laughs> yeah. I have news so important, we have to interrupt this episode with this Skype call. Oh, is it your confession about how you took all the money from the big sale and you're spending it in Hawaii? Okay, but I, I am in Hawaii. <laughs> That's a real thing. But for the record, we planned this trip over a year ago. I know it's a bad look. I didn't know we were gonna find the Modern Rogue World headquarters at exactly this moment. But, oh, no, 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 but, but the news, the news. Yes. So I have had to log in to a billion freaking different accounts. I've had to give, you know, my dog's grandmother's maiden's uh, handmaiden's name and all this stuff. And in the course of all of that, I gave enough information that today I got word that we are provisionally approved to close on the Modern Rogue World headquarters. Barring some kind of crazy unforeseen circumstance, it looks like in, a, in just a couple weeks we're going to be able to show the place off. How amazing is that? Oh, it's blowing my mind. I can't even wrap my mind around it. You went off to paradise, but you sent me something back, a gift to the world, all is forgiven. Good. So now we just have to raise money for the helipad and the other helipad and the tiger pit. Yeah, the, the wingsuits and all that. Wait, you were going with Far Cry, weren't you? Oh, no, I wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good, though. Man, it was a pain in the butt to get everything done with no internet on public terminals and stuff. You got to log into a billion accounts and LastPass saved the day. I know we love all of our sponsors, but this week in particular, I was so, so happy because we talked about on the password episode that if you can remember all of your passwords, then they are not complicated enough and you do not have enough of them. LastPass makes it easy, puts it all in one space for you, and it saved my butt trying to get into long forgotten websites and accounts. Nice, and now you've got the multi-factor authentication that they're using to make it even safer. It's uh, one of the most uh, valuable things you can do and have in your arsenal to protect yourself against hackers. Have you had LastPass grade your passwords yet? No, no, <laughs> I had LastPass generate all of my passwords. My wife asked me, she's like, hey, what's the password to this? I'm like, I don't know, man. Check LastPass. I don't Lower know any passwords Q, anymore. Uppercase P, TMZ Cobra. <laughs> you don't even put TMZ Cobra in there. <laughs> <laughs> no, that would be guessed immediately. <laughs> hey, that's true. That's if you're not familiar with LastPass, click on the link below, check out all their stuff, get on the LastPass hype train, uh, be safe, be smart, have good passwords, and thank you guys for everybody who participated in the sale to raise funds for the Modern Rogue World headquarters. It really does look like it's happening. Let's get back to Rick Smith Jr. My hands. <laughs> All right, what else you got? All right, so the ring finger flick is a really good one where you can hold it in dealer's grip. Mm -hmm. Your thumb and the pad of your uh, hand on the left-hand side, the first finger on top, and the other three down the sides, right? Yes. Also called mechanics grip? Correct. Yeah. So you're gonna bring your thumb over. Thumbing one card over. One card over. And it looks like you're pivoting it on the bottom there? I am there. pivoting on, on this thumb fat. Okay. <laughs> That's the science term. Now what I'm doing from this position is I'm taking my middle finger and... Oh, geez. And then all you're gonna do from this position is take your ring finger mm -hmm. and flick it out. Oh, so it'll look like this. Oh, okay. Nope, it, that's It's gonna finger. work automatically. Okay. So look, you're gonna bring your thumb over. Yep. This finger's gonna give it that little bevel. Okay. And then you're gonna take your, your ring finger and, and just open your hand. I keep wanting to slide it all the way forward. Sure, slide it over, but then bring it back. Okay. Oh, there we go. So, okay, that makes it easier. Now don't use nope, this finger. Yeah, okay. And I'll take, that's it. <laughs> all right, uh, I think I, I got the beginnings of this one. It's gonna do it all by itself. You're just taking that card and flinging it out. <laughs> you got it, I mean, that's it. That, there oh, it is! There we go, there we go, there we go. Good. Moving on, okay. <laughs> all right, good job. We hey, got, there we go, there we go. Okay, okay, two all, in right, a row. all right. Boy, it really, at first, like I've there, got three in a row. Looks. 
and then and then there's Four something clicks, and then you get it. Okay, okay, okay. I did it. You did. See, everyone could do it. Again, all of these are wow. clicks that you really have to just practice over yeah. and over and over again, and waste lots of cards because this is how this is going to. Look at that. <laughs> Dude, that was awesome. He's even given a little bit of flick, and the card's going a little oh, bit wow. farther. Yeah, and if you throw a little wrist action. It gets oh! some good momentum. Did you do it? You did, did it. it. Awesome. All right, what else you got? What Rick, else? you're uh, a, a damn genius. All right, this is a fun one where you can fling the cards from hand to hand. Okay. And so what are you doing? You, you've got it cupped, making like the letter C here. There's d different ways you can use this, this <laughs> utility. <laughs> That's how you do it. I, I just did like five at once. <laughs> All right, you can get about five or six cards in each hand. I guess you would say, what is this, cupping the cards or palming the cards? Yeah, kind of like an exaggerated palm, I guess. Well, let's just start with one. Okay. Okay. There's a line on your thumb. See yep. it? Yep. And you're going to just grab one card in that line. Oh, great. Oh. You did it. And then after it's in that line, take your thumb and and move this way. Oh, so like a swipe right, basically. Whoops. So like this. Did you just compare I, this to Tinder? No, I said you that you actually swipe to the right. Okay. That's, that's, you heard what you want to hear. Okay, sure. That was, that was on me. And you're hedging this bottom edge over yeah, here, like I'm, I'm right into the web of your, your yeah, thumb Yeah, into the web finger. of my thumb. If you don't want to go to that line, go a little bit less. As long as you're opening your hand and moving your thumb to the the right to the side, yeah. It's automatically coming out. I'm not even trying to do anything. It's yeah. You hear that, Brian? It's just kind of happening for him. <laughs> it's just kind of natural. I mean, I'm sure that's how it is. <laughs> that's it. Oh, oh, hey. The faster you move your thumb, the cards are going to spin faster, and you're going to be able to throw it upwards. Uh, and, or and you've shoot got it. all four fingers up top, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. So if you're a gambler, this is something you could use to get a card to your other hand. If you really wanted ah. to do it quick, you would just... Uh, Got it. Again, you can use this to shoot at cameras or targets. Does it matter the size of your hands? Everyone likes to blame, oh, my hands are too small for blah, blah, blah. No, I don't think so. There it is. As long as you can get your thumb in there, it really doesn't matter how big your hand is. Just get that card to spin. That's all you really have to practice. Okay. The more you can get that card to spin, the speed's gonna come with afterwards. Mine are just getting stuck, like where I'm still like gripping it. All right, let's right there. let me let's do it. You gotta open your hand a little bit. Mm -hmm. So here. Oh, okay. That's it. There you go. You Murph's, got it. Murph's got it. I'm actually kind of opening there my hand is. as I'm doing it. Did you get it? I did. Oh, right on. The bikes. Are better? Are way better. Oh! I just did it again. So, well then, here, let's, let's, let's get a different deck of cards. Maybe that'll make a difference. Now, you guys are kind of card fetishists, and I don't mean that it, to make it weird, but like... Oh, it's weird. But that's different, though, like, the finish can, can really affect, Oh, yeah, like, absolutely. Here, uh, absolutely. My, my guess is you're gonna feel this instantly. Oh, yeah, right? yeah, yeah. These are textured. Okay, yeah, th that's called the air cushion finish. Okay. Oh, uh, uh, uh. Uh. I'm gonna declare you the winner on this one because I have not gotten it. This is like me being better at a coin toss. That's, that's, <laughs> like, that's about what's happening here. You got one more? What else? There's a display where you can just take a card and you can display. What I think both of you guys can do that. Okay, what are you doing? You're, you're holding it in the middle. So I'm looking at it face up. Thumb and forefinger, right? Turn okay. it upside down. Yeah. And then I'm just flicking my fingers. Well, so here, here, you got it. Wait. Oh, really? What? I'm just taking my fingers and going like this. Oh, and so you just want to aim it so that it, it spins. You got it. Okay. No. Man, I don't have this one at all. He just tossed it to me and I caught it, so. <laughs> so I mean, it's, uh, that's another point. Simpatico <laughs> right here. It's rotating over your thumb. Yeah. And right now it's pinched between my index finger and the knuckle of my thumb, yeah, right? All I'm doing is this. Oh, oh, yeah, okay. That's it. A little more control. Got it again. <laughs> Score two for Murphy. You got it right. That, that was there it. There it is. I did it. I got it. Nice. Dude, these are fantastic. So that's great. That's four different finger flicking flourishes. Wow. Hey, that's, that's a, a tongue, tongue twister. twister. That's good. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Modern Room. Yeah. Tongue twisters. So where can we see more of this stuff? Oh my gosh. You guys, every other Monday I post new video content on my YouTube channel. Just look up Rick Smith Jr. Yep. Or check the description below and you'll be able to, you'll be able to find me. Dude, you're the best. Thank you so much for no, joining us, man. Thank you guys for having me. That was awesome. Right, it was so much just, fun. Just clean all this up. That'd yeah. be great. Yeah. That's, this is, uh, it's, it's an honor that we're giving you. Oh, yeah.
yeah, for coming. Uh, we do that to all the guests. Appreciate it. Have a good one. Uh, Get a broom. <laughs> <laughs> Is that, okay? is that okay on the wrap-up? Now the lights are all off and we're still here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no. David comes in early tomorrow morning and he's like, car duty, huh? Yeah. <laughs> You're like, you know it's an honor. He's like, that's what they told me. <laughs> <laughs> David's, they let you have car duty? <laughs> Flips over a table. <laughs>